Good morning, guys. Uh, this is the first episode of what I'm gonna call Schneider Time. I'm gonna try to, every Friday morning, record a quick video just to talk to you guys, um, just to give you guys some advice, some thoughts, not as like history thoughts or sociology thoughts or geography thoughts, but I wanna just talk to you about life real quick and just give you some insight um, into what it's like to be, I mean, be an adult. I mean, some of you guys already know a lot about being an adult, but to talk to you about some some practical and some, I think, important lessons that you might need to know even at, uh, at your young age. Um, this is, I've told some of the classes this, uh, I mean, having, <laughs> having six classes two times, I don't know who I told what, but this is going to be the weirdest year uh, of your lives, especially with regard to how school is going to function. And um, hopefully, hopefully it's the weirdest year. If it's weirder than this, then God help us all. But um, it's going to be the weirdest year and uh, hopefully it won't be the hardest year. I, I don't want things to be difficult for you. I think they probably will be in some regard. And you'll notice that I'm not, I'm not one to, uh, to lie to you guys. Um, if I think something's going to be hard, I'm going to tell you it's going to be hard. But at the same time, I don't want to be discouraging. So uh, I think this year could be uh, a very challenging year, but it doesn't have to be the most difficult year uh, of your educational career or your lives. Um, and I know that there will be times when you're going to want to just kind of quit like i'm sure that at some point we're going to go full remote and uh, i'm sure when that happens um your situation you know as far as like how you learn is going to, to change you're going to have to like put more pro you know, take on more responsibility take on more ownership of your education and that might be difficult for some of you so i understand that this year could be very discouraging and so i want to, I want to tell you a quick story that um i heard the story and i'm going to relay it to you guys because it, it, I, I find it encouraging myself i think it results in a, in a great motto for us all. Um, there is a, um, uh, a parachuting school, and I don't know where it was, I've heard, this again, the secondhand story, but um, there's a, a flight instructor there, a, a, dive, a jump instructor, and his job is to teach people how to parachute out of airplanes, okay? And um, don't worry, that's not part of our curriculum. And uh, it's like a three-day parachuting school, and they go through how to pack a parachute, how to use a parachute, how to, how, to, how to jump out of the plane safely, and they go through all these things over a course of three days. On the third day, you do your jump. The third day of the class, they're getting ready to take their jump, and the instructor goes through and tells them, you know, gives a little speech, and he says, you know, all right, you know how to use a parachute. We went over this. We've seen the parachutes. We got our, you know, okay, this is a parachute. You know how this works. Here is the, the main ripcord. Okay, when you jump out of the sh out of the out of the plane, you're going to count to I don't know, they count to one, two, three, four, five. You know, one Mississippi, two Mississippi, whatever. And when it's time, you're going to pull this cord, and your chute will open, and you'll be safe, and you'll fall to the ground. You know how to do that now. Okay. In that one out of a millionth time, where when you pull the rip cord and nothing happens, okay, you go to back to your backup cord. You just pull it, you just pull that one, and your backup chute will open. Okay, and your safety chute opens, and that will help guide you to the earth safely, and you'll be fine. In the one out of a billionth chance that your backup chute doesn't open, I want you to go back to the main ripcord and just keep pulling, and just keep pulling. And then the, and the instructor says to the, to the students, I don't care if you're screeching into the earth at a thousand miles an hour, and you're a you're hundred feet off the ground. I want you, I want to see you come in pulling on that ripcord. Just keep pulling. Don't stop pulling. Because at some point, the chute's going to open. And if, even if the chute doesn't open, don't give up. Don't quit. Just keep pulling that cord. And obviously, it's a scary idea of flying into the earth and your parachute's not open. But I, I love that, I, uh, that, that, that refrain. Just keep pulling the ripcord. No matter how scary things get, no matter how many things around you might fail, your job is to keep pulling the ripcord. Your job is to keep trying to make it. Keep trying to do well in school. You keep trying to get your work done. You keep trying to live life as normally as you can, even though everything around you might be in total chaos. I, I just, don't, I don't care, the guy says, I don't care if you're coming into the earth at a thousand miles an hour, you just, I wanna see you, I wanna see you from the ground pulling that ripcord, 
okay? And so guys, no matter how, th- how difficult things get this semester or this year, uh, no matter how challenging they are, I don't want you to give up. I want you to keep pulling that ripcord, and uh, we'll get through this together, okay? All right, guys, you've got work to do today. If you have any questions, just shoot me an email. Otherwise, I will see you on Monday and Tuesday. Have a good day. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye.